Good evening, viewers, and welcome to this edition of NTV Sports Page. It's Tuesday, the 14th of May, and I'm Curtis Morton. In our headlines, we have an update on the netball tournament ongoing in St. Kitts, and in our feature for this evening, Kings 11 trumps GT United in VPL Finals. We'll take this break, and I'll be right back. Uwali, the Queen of the Caribbeans. Bathed by its crystal shores is the Caribbean's best kept secret. Nevis is known for its rich culture, which remains entrenched in the island's everyday life. We boast of having the Caribbean's greatest summer festival, Culturama. Trouble, trouble, trouble! Let me go! Push forward. I want to hear everybody say, Ready, ready. Well, I'm back and we start with netball. The St. Kitts, Nevis and Gwilla National Bank Netball League continued at the Pam Tyson Netball Complex on Saturday, 11th May. In Game 1, S. Grave Newtown Ballers, 39, Aces, 29. Game 2, Innovative, innovative Keon Pacers, 45, KNJ Otto Rental, Sandy Point United, 11. The upcoming matches should see today, Tuesday, the 14th May, Skills Netball Club versus S. Grave Newtown Ballers at 6.30 p.m. on Court 2. And Aces versus Innovative Keon Paces at 6.45 on Court 1. We go to break and when I come back, we'll have our feature for this evening. Jump up, free up, bet up, no standing up. Love, passion, pride, culture, I'm a party fight. Music, folklore, pageants and so much more. Love, passion, pride, culture, I'm a party fight. Join us from July 25th to August 6th for the Caribbean's greatest summer line. It's Culture Rama 45. Love, passion, pride. 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 Culture Rama 45. Well, I'm back, and tonight we feature cricket. A bumper crowd was on hand on Sunday, 12th May, as the Village Premier League finals took place at the Hard Times playing field. The first match for the third place between SDA Jets and the Jabba's team did not materialize, as the Jabba's team was a no-show. The game was awarded to the SDA Jets, and then the organizers promptly arranged a fill-in game between the Jets and the leftovers team. The Jets batted first and scored 67 for 5 in their allotted 8 overs, with Elroy Kelly top scoring with 25. The leftovers team struggled throughout but still managed to keep interest in the game, requiring 11 runs from the last over bowl by Curtis Morton Sr. They managed just 3 and succumbed at 59 for 7, the Jets winning by 8 runs. The feature of the innings was when 8-year-old when, when Jaden Brown clean bowled Ralph Super Allen for a one-ball duck. But let's take in some of the action.
Immediately after, in the grand finals, the Jitty United Guyanese team won the toss and elected to put the Kings eleven into bat first. It turned out to be a huge mistake. Adelvin Phillip opened the innings with Jelani Manners and the two struck the ball to all parts of the ground, with Phillip in a particularly explosive mood, falling short of a well-deserved century by just seven runs when the overs ran out. The Jitty United team struggled from the start of the innings and even though they had Two main batsmen in Alvin and Annan got starts. It was just not good enough on the day. And the Kings eleven, and one of their main supporters on the boundary line celebrated in a huge way. Summary scores, Kings 11, 154 for 5. Adelvin Phillip, 93. Carlin Smith, 16. Jelani Manners, 13. Blair, 2 wickets. Alvin, 1. Azim, 1. Guy and his team, 80 all out, Alvin 28, Anna 19, Nisbet 4 for 8, Manners 2 for 10, Huggins 2 for 10, Merchant 1 for 19, Kings 11 won by 74 runs. Minister of Sports Honorable Eric Evelyn then presented the top teams and players with their trophies and monetary gifts as follows. Kings 11, Champion Team 1000, compliments of the Honorable Van Zamri. Second place, Jitty United $500, compliments of Honorable Eric Evelyn himself. Third place, SDA Jets $200, compliments of the VPA League organizers. Man of the finals, most runs, and MVP of the tournament at Delvin Phillip, who remarkably only played two matches. Most wickets, Rakish. Minister Evelyn congratulated the organizers of the tournament, the sponsors, the teams, the crowd for making it such a huge success, and he pledged his continued support to such endeavors. Let's now take in some moments from the finals. That will be getting on the way finally. It's going to be Alvin to bowl to Adelvin. And so Delvin Phillip taking strike. He was the man of the match from last week's match, semi finals. And we'll now allow the main commentators to take over at the far end. Oh, first ball, that's one far. That's a magnificent shot by Delvin Phillip. What a way to start this final. Dragging it down was a Delvin and a Del um, was Alvin and a Delvin Philip rocked back and pulled them way out of the grounds for six. That's gone. That's a magnificent hit. That's gone sailing like a kite. Well, it's gonna be Blair. Blair normally off a very long run. Races in now to ball to Jelani. Manners was high, hard, and handsome. That's a brilliant hit. That's gone looking mangoes. Oh, and right away the Guyanese have called for some extra fielders. Four of them to be exact. They need fielders all around the ground. I'm sorry for them the way these guys are going. He's a competitor. As he races in now to bowl to the exciting left hander Jelani Man, as he bowls, gets a yorker like delivery, digs it out. Well bowled, good comeback by Blair. The field is set far and wide. All of the men lying in the boundary. There's not a single man in for Adelphi Phillip. Not a man inside. As he races in now, Blair, off that long run, bowls to Delvin, he swings it in the air! Oh, it's going to fall short, and a poor feeling, awful feeling, as they go back for the second, and they get it easily, but that was a miss hit by Delvin Phillip, racing in now, to bowl to Phillip, bowls, he's swinging! There's a low shout! And the umpire is unimpressed. Blair has made a bit of a comeback so far after being struck contemptuously for six by Jelani. Here goes now. Bowls to his oh brilliant delivery. Good comeback by Blair. This is cricket at its best, I can tell you. Brilliant Yorker. As he races in, does Blair. In now to bowl to Philip. Another brilliant delivery. Goes under the bat of a drive in a Delvin Philip. Shoot to the keeper. A good comeback. He goes, moves in now to bowl. Oh, that went past Blair like a rocket. If Blair had gotten his hand to that, I think his hand would have gone to the fence with it. My goodness, that went past him like a bullet from a gun. And Blair is disappointed that he didn't catch it. But my goodness, I think he should be happy that he didn't get his hand to it. Oh, that went past him like a rocket. Oh, 
Oh, that's a full toss and it's gone for six. Oh, it's gone. Dragging it down. It's gone. Over square leg for six. He goes once more to bowl to the aggressive Philip. Shot six more. That's gone even further. He punches it to the upside. That's a lovely shot. That's more. Oh, he just raced across his stumps and blessed it to the upside for four. Here he goes now. Huggins to bowl to the new man. Oh, he swung it. I don't know how he played that shot. Oh! And Carl and Smitten. It's as if the ball was playing dodging hope with him. He was going one way and the ball was going the next. He's on before. Moves in now to bowl. Deep now said the time he might be out. Look at this roll, look at this roll. Look at this roll. My goodness, he has to be a dead man. Well, well, well. That celebration. Moved in now to bowl. In the air. Well shot of Philip. And they'll get a single. Go ball him! <laughs> what is the celebration going to be now? What, what are we going to get here? Well, I think he's coming out to celebrate with the team. But I think there's another batsman to bat. No, they've pulled up the stump. That's it. Game done. Hey. Um, Carlin Smitten, how does it feel? Well, it's good. It feel good to win a championship. Did you expect it to be so easy? No, no, no. Not so easy. I know when you come up against the Guyanese, they could play hard. But you played a good game, started well with the Delvin and um, no, no. Gagliolani. Yeah. yeah, and after that, it seems as if they were out of the game. All, always. All right. Congratulations. All right. Congratulations, guys. Well, that's our package for this evening. I am Curtis Morton, reminding you that you can watch sports if you are not fit. But to play sports requires fitness, diligence, and sacrifice. Have a good night.